Hello friends, my name is Theo and today in this exciting Meissner Media tutorial, we're going to be taking a look at adding a lens flare to some footage with the new point tracker in DaVinci Resolve 12.5. Also new in 12.5.1 is GPU accelerated lens flare, so this is just, you know, two birds with one stone. Here we've got some footage, awesome, looks mediocre at best. I just shot it while I was out on a walk and decided to do this tutorial and I said I need some footage for that. So, we will go to our tracker first, then make sure we have FX enabled. Click on this little button down here. Click on the point you want to track, which in this case is a sun and not even a point, but it's DaVinci Resolve, so it is, you know, just good at everything. Well, good at some things. Hit track forward, and you'll see, whoop, look at that. Things are moving. Very cool. Very cool. And now that's hopefully working. I'm going to go over to Open Effects. Go to Lens Flare, drop a bad boy on there, and you'll see, just like that, it's sticking. Isn't that cool? So of course it's interacting with my actual lens flare, but you know, no one will know the difference. And you can of course change things. I'm always a fan of the anamorphic handy cam because it's just so ridiculous. Oh, there you go. That's a little nicer modern sci-fi. Mask threshold up, down, light source size, etc. Let's crank that up. And let's make the glare color blue because it's sci-fi. Nice. Cool. So just like that. You get sweet J.J. Abrams magic for, you know, super easy. I've been wanting a point tracker in Resolve just for stuff like this for a long time, and now we have it. So, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you liked it, leave it a like. If you didn't give it a dislike, no matter what, leave your feelings down in the comments below. Be sure to share this video with your friends, because everyone likes crazy lens flares. Lucy did, however many years ago that was. Light leaks are basically the new lens flares, which if you need some excellent light leaks, go on to meesnermedia.com slash products and check out the Bright Lights Light Leak Pack, which would go excellent with these crazy new lens flares, I'm sure, if you just want to just make light explosions in your footage. The more light explosions you use, the less good your footage has to look originally. So, you know, keep that in mind. I know I take advantage of that fact all the time. Don't tell anyone. Also, House Luts and the Carnival Power Grades. Very cool. Once again, I've been Theo with Meester Media. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you next time. Bye.